Okay. I guess we're gonna go there. One of these is a chimpanzee and the other one is a homo sapien. Just because bones look identical doesn't mean they're the same thing. Evolution is fascinating, but evolution doesn't happen at the same rate for everything. Now evolution itself is the concept of an organism eventually speciating, turning into a different species, due to a mixture of random genetic mutations which are positive and the selective pressures of the environment that it lives in. And this TikTok creator, Just Jesus, has given us a really good example of a thing called evolutionary stasis. This is basically where an animal doesn't evolve very much because there's no need to. It's as simple as that. Now, why that happens, there are several reasons. One might be environmental conditions. See, lobsters themselves have lived in relatively stable marine conditions since we've ever known they've existed. Their body plan, behaviors, and physiology lend them to be in really good positions for marine environments. Without any major environmental selective pressures, there's been no need for the lobsters to evolve dramatically. Another reason may be efficient design. See, lobsters, they look really bizarre. They almost look like aliens from another planet, but their structures and their hard exoskeletons make them very good at fending off predators. And then you add into their segmented design and their claws, they're pretty robust and they've managed to survive a lot of stuff over the years. They're excellent at scavenging, hunting, avoiding predators. So making any evolutionary changes just doesn't make any sense. Lobsters have occupied the same ecological niche for hundreds of millions of years. And since their role in the food chain and the marine ecosystems hasn't changed very much, well, there's no reason to evolve. And to be clear, they don't choose to evolve. There's just been no strong evolutionary pressures like environmental changes. And it's also worth noting there is a thing called fossil bias. You see, we only find stuff in the fossil record that is durable enough to be found. And lobsters themselves have hard exoskeletons, which is why we see them nicely in this image behind me. But we don't know what the internal structures or any of the soft fragments would have been of these lobsters. They could be vastly different and all we're seeing is the skeletal remains of both these lobsters, which look similar. Evolutionary stasis isn't just reserved for lobsters. There are many other animals around the world that have gone through this stagnancy. So we have things like the horseshoe crabs, these bizarre looking creatures. They haven't changed for over 450 million years. We have the coelacanth, which are like these lungfish, which haven't changed in over 360 million years. In fact, we actually thought they were extinct until we found them recently. That's pretty amazing. Like crocodilians. Crocodiles have existed in their same shape and form for hundreds of millions of years. How about sharks? I mean, the goblin shark looks exactly the same as it did 450 million years ago. And it's not just reserved to animals. Like the gingo tree has basically remained unchanged for the last 200 million years. And then you have things like velvet worms, lampreys, sturgeons, tuataras. There are plenty of them. So yeah. I hope you learned something today. If you didn't, well, rewatch the video or my other videos. But yeah, thanks so much for watching. Like, comment, share, follow, and I'll see you in the next one.